show copy quality for release printing is the aim of laboratories throughout the world. To achieve this, the negatives must be handled carefully and consecutively. Rank Film Laboratories have designed a complete commercially effective printing system currently in use at their Denham Laboratory, which totally overcomes the problems of individual reels. We have succeeded in printing and processing complete feature films in one pass. The system has five stages, the first of which is negative examination. Action and sound negatives are checked for damage or scratches and the condition of all the splices is examined at the same time. Cleanliness is essential, so the operators wear special anti-static suits to reduce the presence of particulate matter. Once the negatives have passed the condition check, they are ready for cleaning and assembling in feature lengths. The reels of negative with their academy leaders are spliced together in sequence and run through the Solvit film cleaner at speeds in excess of 350 feet per minute. Finally producing a complete feature length reel of 4,000 meters or 13,000 feet on a large center. The frame count and reel lengths of the negatives are rechecked during this cleaning operation using the counter incorporated in the machine. This cleaning process treats and conditions the film and stops the formation of static on subsequent rewinding. The modular winder is designed to slave against the cleaning machine as well as the printing and developing machines. This method of winding uses very low tensions but the finished roll is hard and true without the need for side supports producing reliable negative protection. Feature length rolls create special transport problems, so the negatives require a special trolley. Handling is all done on the large center, another important safeguard. The queuing and timing information is generated using a computerized frame count queuing system designed and installed by rank film laboratories as an integral part of the operation to reduce errors whilst recording grading or timing information. In the grading process, as soon as the timer is satisfied with the picture on the analyzer, he presses a single key and the queuing and timing information is automatically captured on the computer disk. The program allows up to 14 operators access to the computer simultaneously. Once the timing has been established to the satisfaction of the customer, a punch tape of the feature length reel is composed and subsequently produced by the computer. This tape is immediately checked by the computer against the data on the disk, reducing the opportunity for errors. The feature negatives then move to the printing room. The modular winders are arranged around the printing machine giving the operator good continuous visibility of the negatives and stock. The sound negative is loaded onto a winder on the left hand side of the printing machine and the action negative is loaded on the right. The sync marks are placed in the printing apertures. The punch tape is entered into the microcomputer control unit. This unit acts as a diagnostic brain, reading the tape, rechecking the data, monitoring the printing machine and module winders, both prior to and during the printing operation. Raw stock is prepared as a separate operation using the frame line winder. Rolls of an exact predetermined length are made up in advance of printing and stored in a light, tight box. This preparation removes a critical operation from the printing cycle. The frame line winder is specially designed to enable stock to be spliced together, all the splices to be on the frame line, total footage to be predetermined which in turn gives splice free copies high running speeds of 2000 feet per minute with a controlled start and finish.
After this winding operation, the stock is sunk up to the action negative. The printing machine is started and it gently ramps up to speed. Throughout the cycle, tensions are carefully controlled. The printing machine is bidirectional, so the next run is the same operation, but in reverse. On completion, the printed copy is transported to the developers, again using one of the special trolleys. It is then fed directly into the developing machine. As the developed copy comes off, it is broken down into double reels. The densitometric information on the end of each reel is fed into a computer to constantly monitor the printing and developing machine performance. Finally, when printing is complete, both action and sound negatives are stored together in feature length for as long as the negative is in current use. This system is thoroughly proven and offers the answer to those seeking show copy quality for release printing. Every time you get protection of negative condition, effective use of operational resources, uniformly high quality prints, Satisfied customers.